Well, we're here at the National Civil War Naval Museum in Columbus, Georgia. The most important artifact in here is the remains of the CSS Jackson, one of the ironclads that the Confederate Navy constructed, constructed right here in Columbus. And it's one of the largest at 225 feet long and 57 feet wide. And there aren't many of these ironclads left for us to be able to study. And we've got the, the biggest one right here. Uh, we've also got the flag collection. We've got the largest naval flag collection from the Civil War on display anywhere. And then we've got reproductions of the USS Hartford, which was the flagship of Admiral David Farragut, and the USS Monitor, the famous turreted uh, ironclad that the Union put together, and a mock-up of the CSS Albemarle, a typical Confederate ironclad. There are many things that you can experience here. It's outside what people normally think of with the Civil War, the armies clashing at Gettysburg, and it's the Battle of Hampton Roads, it's, it's the Battle of Mobile Bay, and probably the most, one of the most famous naval quotes of all time, which is, damn the torpedoes, full steam ahead. That's, that's Admiral Farragut at Mobile Bay in 1864. And, and it's the daily life of a sailor, not just white, but also black men. African Americans play a very important role in the Navy. The U.S. Navy is actually more integrated in the Civil War than it is during World War II. They've got to learn how to not only to operate the big guns, and we're not talking about little bitty field pieces, we're talking about 15,000 pound cannons that are firing 110 pound projectiles. All of that just plays into it and you come in and really experience that.